Hi everyone, it's Nick here from Arc Property. Uh, in today's video, I'm going to show you properties in Glasgow that will achieve you a 14% ROI and an 8% yield. So if you like the sound of that, keep watching. Uh, so here I am in Crawfoot. Uh, this is an area of Glasgow uh, which is made up of predominantly cottage flats. These are cottage flats here behind me. Uh, three bedrooms and they have their own garden as well. Now from an investor's point of view these are quite good for renting out. Uh, I've got a few already that I manage for other clients. Uh, they rent out really well uh, to families usually because they have a private garden. Uh, so really worth looking at. Just to give you an idea of figures, uh, you can pick one of these up for about 80 to 85,000 in walk-in condition. Uh, and you'd be looking to rent that out at 550 a month, unfurnished. Um, so the demand is good for these. I've just rented out a couple there. Uh, we've had loads of demand and there's no problem getting a good tenant in. Just to run through the figures, you'd be looking to pick one up for about 80 to 85 on a 75% loan to value mortgage uh, with your deposit and all your legal fees and stamp duties. You're at about £25,000 all in for the investment. Link to rent that out at £550 a month. So after your lettings, fees, uh, insurance and mortgage, you're probably left with a cash flow of about £300 a month. So cash flow in £300 a month um, and a good return of 14% on your investment. Gross yield, you're probably talking about 8% but I never really go on yield, I always go on ROI. Just think it's a much better indicator. So these properties have got their pros and cons. Uh, one of the advantages is you've not got any factors fees at all. So usually if you're buying a block of flats, then you obviously have to pay your share of the maintenance. Uh, but with these, it's totally up to you what you do. So it's best if you can to try and get one that has been uh, re-roofed and re-rendered recently. On the downsides, uh, there's not much chance of capital growth. Um, so these pre-credit crunch were going for about 90 maximum. Uh, they then dropped to probably going for about 70 and now they're back up at about the 80 to 85 mark. Uh, so they don't really move too much in price, but for a good cash flowing a uh, high returning investment, they are a good option. So I hope you find that video helpful. Uh, this is called the Croft Foot area of Glasgow, uh, which also runs into Rutherglen and Kings Park as well. Uh, so there's loads of these properties on the market. They're all around about the 80 to 85,000 pound mark um, and good return for the investor. Take care guys, have a great weekend. Speak to you later.